Hi Aries, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back to your monthly romance vlog and this is your romance reading for June 2020 and we're already in June so if you've got anybody around you that's a Gemini happy returns to them and enjoy the party if you're going to have a party if you're going to go to the party right I'm using a new deck I hope you have watched the weekly because there will be a competition and you can win a brand new uh, sh the shadow tarot deck from Monica Bordersky and um, I've done the weeklies with them and also the house of shadow and it's a really extended reading it's a lovely reading and I hope you enjoy it and I will put out a video on my website and I will keep tabs on the community button on YouTube uh, updates um, as to what is happening and how and when I'll be uploading the video um, for what you have to do in order to win the decks and yes there will be also an other deck okay that's the Pfizer first deck I've used this deck and it's still in impeccable order so if you would like the Pfizer first deck then you're more than welcome and you've got the cards and vice versa means that you've got the cards on both sides and the book is beautiful but um, I just do this because I want to keep the website happy and exciting and I want to get together that's my saying let's get together and that's what we're doing it is even better nowadays than what it was it's getting better and better every day the cyber family is growing rapidly and it's awesome and thank you very much to all my cyber angels for the support towards each other and uh, being so respectful and beautiful in the tea room so if you're new welcome to the channel please subscribe and hit that bell on all and then you'll be notified when new videos are loaded up or when I go live that's Monday Wednesday and Friday and I give away free cards and I also answer questions if they are supported with a donation and that can be super sticker or a super chat if you like an extended reading with me personally um, then go and have a look because I do videos as well I do personally ones and record them whatever your choice and see what uh, readings are on offer on the website you can do that by looking at the information in the description box or clicking that little white uh, circle in the corner the right hand corner in the video okay I hope you're all well and safe so let's get started your first card is pretty good Aries and you as you have the six of wands you've got public recognition and look at everybody cheering and all the balloons going up and streamers celebrating how fantastic you are you have victory you're the champion okay you might be going on holiday you could be going on holiday with your partner if you're hooked up and if you're not hooked up you could be going on holiday and meet a partner on holiday and you could be moving home so you might be meeting a new person in your new area you're going forwards and upwards there might be promotions as well if this was a general reading there might still be promotions okay you have the seven of cups where the seven of cups is your dreams and goals card and I usually say make a priority list and see which dream or goal or wish could come true first because it takes action to fulfill it by manifesting visualizing or even getting into action and doing it asking somebody out or going to um, an um, a job interview if that is your wish or go and look at a house if you want to buy a house if you are hooked up then perhaps that is a wish that will be coming true so long you take action you will have victory good for you 
in the second week of June we've got the Knight of Cups. If you're not hooked up then you could be meeting a Cancer, a Scorpio or a Pisces. News will come to you by from a person that could be a water sign but news will come to you this could be an offer of love or an offer of a wish as you've, she has the star in her hand and the star represents a wish or a goal so wow 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 and that's why I like uh, uh, one of the reasons why I like uh, the uh, how, uh, Shadowlands because they are so explicit the uh, they're full of depths and they've got um, they're not just 2d they're 3 or 4d they've got so much information look at her bra made out of seashells and look at the Sun cancer is July so perhaps you're going on holiday in July uh, August and you've got the heart here and the cups there right and the and the starfish okay I love these these cards and also these they're so beautiful really and again you've got the white and the black you can't do without the black one or the other okay you've got the moon so listen to your intuition and again this could be a Pisces as moon represents Pisces there's a new beginning you've got number 11 the angels are with you and the doorway you've got a porthole to step through you are in the spotlight you are being recognized awesome some that could be a Pisces that has an eye on you they're loving passionate caring nurturing sensual sensual and sexy people in them in that could even the man could be even sensual okay he could be nurturing it's beautiful but there's also a dark side to the moon don't forget that you've got the dark side so you might need more information before you start this relationship in order uh, to keep your emotions under control Wow and be balanced in the third week you've got the six of cups perhaps somebody might be coming back from the past bringing you a gift and you might have a cup of tea with them or celebrate with them because this is like looks more like a party okay you might also be reminiscing about good times in the past awesome sorry if I sliss but I've just had a tooth extracted so it's a bit painful but I'm trying to do my best and wow 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 we were talking about a star and look what you've got here you have the star and that is an Aquarius that a star represents Aquarius so there could also be an air sign in your vicinity that you and um, that has an eye on you the moon as it's lying next to the moon your wish or goal is coming true so be careful what you wish for you definitely have the wish cup in the beginning of the month and it could be coming true in the third week perhaps on holiday you've got the ace of cups the ace of love the ace of emotions passion nurturing caring sensuality and sexuality so there is a new beginning okay wow 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 and you can meet cancer Scorpio or Pisces and you have the full if you can try to get more information because the moon means there is something hidden that you don't know about you need more information and also with the seven of cups but jump in take that leap of faith because you've got the full um, if but don't jump in too much in the deep end it is a warning okay keep an open mind okay the overall energy that you have from the uh, Shadowlands is 
discretion and that's judgment get an other perspective it could mean uh, don't um, remember the good times with somebody in the past but get a different perspective let the past go so that you don't compare the new person with the present uh, with the past sorry there could be somebody coming back because judgment means somebody's um, Gabriel this is an owl but the Gabriel blows air into the rising dead here you are the rising the dead are rising they are together so there could be a second chance a rebirth it means rebirth it might be a rebirth of an existing um, relationship or it could be that somebody has left you and is coming back get a different perspective get a new perspective use your wisdom the owl is wisdom beautiful 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 I like the way this reading is going you've got the eight of cups you are looking towards a new beginning you want adventure you want excitement you want love by the re look of the reading you want love you want somebody that is nurturing caring loving and sharing although sharing uh, is not um, um, an essential meaning of any uh, suit but that also belong belongs in a relationship sharing give and take compromise respect equilibrium don't throw old shoes away before you have new ones all right my darling that is what I'm hearing now you've got the silver angel feather that is beautiful you can meditate on it you can wear silver and you in clothes or in jewelry but you can't eat silver unless it's silver icing <laughs> And you've got the silver angel feather connect with the moon connect with the moon the angels advise you to sit out or walk in the moonlight yes beautiful romantic the moon's energies will light up your path and protect you on your way the silver angel feather is pre pre presented to you as a symbol of encouragement yes give somebody a second chance like I said even if they come back from the old days give them a second chance but get a new perspective and protection silver is a mixture of colors black and white the moon's silver energy removes emotional restrictions and restores equilibrium to your energy body the angels would like you to enjoy emotional balance clear insight and clarity if you are involved in a difficult situation with a friend family or mm, uh, uh, a family member or a colleague this clarity will aid you to resolve the situation for protection visualize yourself totally surrounded by silver a special silver mesh perhaps the silver mesh is a link to the spiritual realm that protects your stability and psychic protection by deflecting negativity awesome she's also sitting in the moonlight or in the sunlight either but you've got a lot of moon now the angels that are here uh, are Archangel Gabriel the angel of moon energy and also Haniel but Haniel is also the angel of the heart open your heart and Archangel Michael the angel of protection and you can wear silver or hematites so protect yourself don't compare the past with the present and the last card for you is keep an open mind 
well what did I say I said somewhere here keep an open mind your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations that is if it's somebody new and if it's a present partner and like I said it might go up next level because I saw a staircase here climbing up 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 take that leap of faith they might have changed but they might uh, might not be to your expectations have an open mind that they have changed or they have improved themselves give somebody a second chance listen and learn get a different perspective I love this reading and if you do give somebody a second chance good luck and know that you're protected by Ga uh, Gabriel Haniel and Michael no you're not alone I love this reading take care and be beautiful and stay safe and please share and like and I hope to see you in the life if not in the next video ciao ciao